In this video, we are going to um, learn how to add categories and tags to our posts. So let's go in here. We just added a new post, and let's talk about categories a little bit. Categories are actually the chapter titles to a book. So for example, here we have the names of some of the designers here. Uh, and the ones that were that are active right now are all marked with the uh, their art and eco designer and artist. And those are the chapter titles to this. You don't want too many chapter titles, so I'm going to discourage you from adding additional categories. Let's just stick to the artists as the categories. But tags, that's where you can get busy and really have some fun work. So I added vertigree, uh, vertigris embossing powder as a tag. You could add other tags. Be specific with your tags. Um, be uh, very specific with your tags. You just like say um, uh, specific tag, for example. And then you would go down here and hit add new tag. Um, that is about all you'd have to do on it. Uh, so think about that and actually think about doing that before you add your blog post. Think about what tags that post could use and add them in advance. I'll show you where you can see them on the website. So if you scroll to the top of your dashboard and click Visit Website, right underneath the name of the website, you'll see here, and we scroll down to the bottom of the website, there's recent posts. We just posted Tea Time in the Orient with Art and Echo. The category is Holly Brown. There is, this is going to be a tag cloud, and the most popular tags will be a little bit bigger in size than the ones that are only used once or twice. But as you add tags, think about how often they're going to be used. If they're already on the site, just use one that's already there. And then this, of course, will eventually be a drop-down showing the months that uh, uh, people can click on and see the, the blog posts for August and September and so forth if they want to go check on things. Or they could check and just look under categories, look for Holly Brown posts or um, Sabrina Friel posts or Ann Ryan posts. Exactly. Um, so anyway, that's a little bit about it. And here you can see how this post actually went straight to uh, the Facebook page. And that is the um, image we put at the very end. That image where I said, oh yes, I've got to add this one. This is that image. If you don't add it, you might get something up there. Facebook will pick a picture. It may not pick the picture you want. So that's a little bit about categories and tags. Again, think of tags as the index of the book and the categories as the chapter titles.